and dancing just flex. Real flag boss, you know what just flex? Just flex, tell them some prior words. Just flex, keep your posted all on your crews, you know what just flex with. Subscribers, much respect for this old boy. Number one, Mr. Ya just flex. Yeah, what go on, what go on, peeps? Bless up, bless up, bless up, bless up, bless up. I just flex, just a forward in. Yeah, come to give you guys one update and also share a couple of videos that you know, say, yo, we don't like the one. Keep up the time, yes. So, two times yesterday, Mona come and get shot up. Yes, so Mona come and in Papin St. Andrew. Yeah, got shot up two times yesterday. And one man was shot and injured. And he's only identified as Andy. Well, he's at the hospital in serious condition, right? Yes, peeps. So, yesterday is like, Gunmen went to come and shoot up come on, and then went away and then return again and just go shoot up come on again. So two times yesterday, one place get shot up. And then go one man injured in the process. Right? And he's only identified as Andy. So we chat this story, but for now, just to be in recent weeks, Mona come and become a next battlefield. Yeah, we're constant, you know. Gun firing because a couple of weeks back a man was shot and killed. Yes, you know. So, a couple of weeks back a man was standing, you know, a section in the community when he was pounced upon by gunmen who opened fire at him. He and the next man were standing, but the next man ran, leave him. So, just a bit sad. So, Mona Kaman constantly warfare, and the alleged report is that he's a thief and thing. Yeah, gunmen went after, but we chat that. So in the meantime, when I keep up no more time, just watch the videos we we'll soon forward up top. All right, guys. I know most of you guys gonna feel bad to see a lady hunger. A machete like that handling her machete so right here <laughs> we are at the foot of spur tree and I say gutters you're leaving gutters it's gonna be the last call going up the hill that you're heading to spur tree here we have this beautiful lady handling her machete goes by the name of hustler babes and you know, as she prepared this coconut for somebody else. Yeah, as you can see, business is going pretty good. People tend to stop and find him. That's my father there drinking a coconut. My nephew there, he had his already. Mine is still right by the bucket. You see, she has her sanitation area. You get your wash hand. Right here, she's just handling her stuff, throwing in. What? Wow, she flip it. Guess what? I get in her nervous today, you know. But guess what? <laughs> you know, she didn't expect me, guys. So I just came on board here. But this is not normal. Not regular. You see somebody haggling a machete like that. You gotta come to Saint Elizabeth and Manchester to find this type of a woman. They're hardworking, you know. And guys, you don't don't. I don't want you guys to even look over this side, okay? And she'll tell you her story because in 2020 her stall was burnt down that I've learned. And she's determined not to allow that. It's not stopless me and it doesn't matter what with the people, the one many people do them just can't stop me because since they have burned down the stall, this thing has been very, very good for me. It has been better. Yes, it has been better because you know. Um, on my phone here, I have this photo on my phone. This photo on my phone, right here. Um, dozens of people have seen this this picture all over the media. Yes, and this picture let come here just to support my business because they come and they say, "Girl, I see the picture all over social media. So I had to come here and give you a support." So you know, whatever do people do, they can because I believe in God, and yes, I'm always gonna be here on my hustle. All right, so you you have just mentioned one thing. You're you're, not, you're a woman who believes in God, yes. and 
I think that's where you get all your strength. You know, this is my first time here as a customer and I can feel your energy and you have some real positive energy. I've seen the people who have stopped by your customer, one of the guy there, you know, he said, guess what? We don't know. Dear Jamaicans, I would like for you guys to know that our country is loved and appreciated by everyone world wide. If you have never traveled before, you go to any foreign country, Jamaicans are loved. We need to keep that positive vibe going for the country. All of the corruption, the scamming, the killing, all the unnecessary drama. We need to start eliminate that out of the country. We're a small island with very powerful people. We're a very blessed country. For, for such a small island, we can accomplish so much. Them say little but with Talawa. That's not an understatement. It's about time people start appreciate the country. Not break it down. If you come to a place like the United States and they hear an accent and they're like, where are you from? Oh, I'm Jamaican. They get so excited. It's like they fall in love with you that very minute. But yet people are back home not knowing that's the kind of love we get. So when you start doing all these negative things, calling a person like me, I am a Jamaican, born and raised in Jamaica. Okay? I'm here in the United States. Yes, I'm serving the country. But at the end of the day, I never forget my roots. Full-blooded Jamaican. Whether I'm a U.S. citizen or not, I claim Jamaica all the way. Look. Almost every Jamaican in the United States have a flag in them car. Almost every last one. That's how much we pride our country. But yet people in Jamaica don't take the same pride in the country. That doesn't make any sense. Any sense at all. Alright? And I know it starts from the top, the government. Like everybody needs to play a part. We're too loved and too appreciated for do some stupid stuff like this. If everybody come together and unite and try to uplift the country, the country will do better. Trust me, the country will do better. If I am a Jamaican and I meet another Jamaican in the United States, we immediately become family. Why you can't do that to Jamaica too? Why you can't do that to Jamaica too? I know there's so much people out there who can verify for what me I say right now. If me see a Jamaican right now, me give them everything I have. You know, if I ask for you, if I say you want it, you go get it. You are Jamaican, I go look out for you. Yo, people are work hard. Hard up here, no? No found there, Jamaica, on a call, on a big money every minute. Like people are, like people are pick up money. Yo, if you're hungry, Jamaica, you can go pick a, you can go pick a fruit or go eat, eat something. You can go your neighbor yard, go beg them some rice and some sugar. You can't do that up here, sir. You have to buy everything. Only can not grow on the crop and them thing there. We can't do them something there up here, sir. And more time people have to work the place freezing cold. Only now feel them something there, Jamaica. But yet, you call people, you beg money, and you throw the money because I guess you can come beg some more. That's not right. That's not right. If you know if you learn and appreciate certain things, maybe you know the deal with the place, sir. I know the deal with people, sir. We a whole heap of family of victims of, of own exploitation in a Jamaica. Yeah, cause guess what? My family, them, they are foreign. Me can call them and beg them money and just squander the money and then call them and beg some more. We know enough Jamaicans are work out two, three jobs just to take care of them family. Yo, Jamaicans, you need to start appreciating things more. Like for real. You need to start appreciating things more. You need to start valuing things more, yeah? Because people work too hard. God bless everybody now. Everybody get the same 24 hours. So why you can't get up and go look at work? Like for real. We need everybody to share that video here. And pass on the message. Because I know how to feel my sentiments right now. Jamaica. I love Jamaica. I love every Jamaican. 
But a full time we reunite and start shed some positivity in the country, here. Yeah? Full time. God bless. Together. Yes, yeah, so welcome back, welcome back. Bless up again, to peeps. The country. Yes. The country will yes, do better. So. Trust me, the country will do Just better. Just to be Mona Kaman. If I am a Jamaican and I meet Papi another Saint Jamaican Andrew. in the United States, so yeah, immediately become family. Recent weeks become a battlefield and a choir. And too? then now, just to be Why a spurty can't do that Jamaica woman. Too? We are shot burned down and things. There's so much people out there yeah, she find back who can verify for women right You know, I think right up or thing a work for her. And also, this if soldier, you know, where right resided in America. We give them you know, for also in the say US you Army, you which is a Jamaican, Jamaican so she make the Jamaican people them know how valuable the them is. So we have to cherish one another, you know, stop this club in a bar and hold them thing. But my peeps, it's not going to stop. We're going to do this. Like people have, like people have pick up money. I want to see you in the comment. Yo, if you're hungry in Jamaica. And them for no side, Jai Meds, representing for Just Blex. Just Blex, tell them to pray your words. When the healings are trying for you, was he a dire hurt? The most I alert, if I them alone, them alone. Yeah, man, just vex. You don't know your success getting them upset, you know what I mean?